Yo, what's going on guys? It's Fikats here and Lunar Client is released. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to download and install it and show you the basics of the client. Now, be sure to leave a like if this video helps you and also leave a like and a comment if you want me to do a 100% you know complete walkthrough of lunar client showing you guys every single feature but um, without wasting any more time what you want to do to download the client is go to lunar.gg slash client I'll leave a link in the description as you can see you're gonna see the download now button you're gonna click on that it's gonna download this file right here you're gonna click on save and then you're going to go and open it I can see I have three failed attempts at trying to record this video but as you can see it does say that Windows is trying to protect your PC but this is only saying this because it is from an unknown publisher in the future they are going to make it where it is a known publisher they just have to sign their application um, they state that down here in the fact right here but anyways all you're gonna want to do is click on the more info and then click on run anyways and then it's you can't see this um, but it is a uh, user account control is asking me if I want to allow this app to make changes in my computer you're just gonna want to click on yes then it's going to open up the Lunar Client setup. You can read this if you want to, but um, you know I don't think a lot of people read that anyway. So I'm just like agree. And then it's going to start installing everything for the launcher. As you can see, I left that unedited just so you can see how long it took me to install everything. And then as you can see, it's going to automatically open up the client or the launcher, and it's going to put a, an icon on your desktop. Now, if you want to allocate more RAM, all you have to do is go to Settings, and then as you can see, you have this very simple little slider here. Now to launch the client, obviously you just click on launch client and it might take a while the first time. It's going to say connecting for a little while. I'm going to leave this part unedited too just so you can see how long it takes me to do it. But um, yeah, they were having issues before. Um, it is, as you can see, it's 3 a.m. right now. So they released it at like 1 a.m. But people were having a lot of launching issues. But as you can see, they've pretty much got all those fixed. Um, as you can see now, the client is launching up screen's going to be black for a second but now as you can see we are on the lunar client homepage now I can see you've got cosmetics up here hopefully they'll slide me some of my capes into here so I'll have some of those dope capes um, you got account switcher <laughs> um, lunar client up here you got your regular minecraft options and then multiplayer you have um, you know pin server obviously lunar we're just going to connect to this so I can show you some of the stuff as you can see I already have some of my mod profiles set up your game is not going to look like this when you launch up yours is going to look like this um, but to edit your mods you're just going to want to press right shift and then click on mods like I said I'm going to be doing a 100% tutorial on how all this works if you guys like this video and leave a comment but um, basically you guys can figure it out for yourself just going through the mods um, pretty much like cheat breaker if you use cheat breaker then you should know you know pretty much how to use everything in the client but other than that um, one quick thing I noticed there is no radio anymore I'm pretty sure that the radio was in lunar client before I think try hard PvP showed it off on his live stream so I'm not sure why it's not here anymore but um, hopefully they'll add something better than that maybe like some way to play YouTube playlist or Spotify playlist hopefully that's in the works um, but I'm not too sure but anyways if you have any questions about how to use the client um, be sure to leave them in the comment section below and if you are having issues with launching any bugs crashing stuff like that be sure to report it on the forums I'll leave a link in the description to where you can report those at um, don't make a bug or don't make a regular forum post don't make a freaking um, don't spam them in the discord make it through like the official ticket system because that's gonna be much easier for them to you know read and you know don't spam them either because they're working as hard as they can to you know fix everything for everyone so yeah that's pretty much it for this video if you did enjoy be sure to leave a like if it helped you out be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more stuff in the future and i'll catch you guys later peace